everyone, my name is Ariel and welcome back to my channel. My husband Sam and our dog, Tabor, <laughs> are back in our van. Uh, believe it or not, we actually did go home since we last saw you, but we're back in the southern Utah area. But just for the night, we're actually headed on our way to Sedona for a fun little adventure over there. And we just kind of like wisened up and got a little bit slower with the way that we move. I talked about this a couple of vlogs ago that we just are trying not to rush around so much like we usually do. And so we gave ourselves two days to do the drive, which means that we get to have just a nice relaxing evening instead of driving late into the night. So we are stopped at um, just a reservoir really that's near the highway and there's like easy access camp spots all along it. And it is just like, a beautiful beautiful day it's obviously like a little bit windy you can probably hear the wind um but yeah we're super excited we're just gonna have a nice relaxing evening here and then we're gonna hit the road in the morning drive the rest of the way maybe do some sort of like hike or bike ride if it's not windy in the morning we may also paddleboard here but we only have one so we'll see rock paper scissors yeah <laughs> so it's like two people and one dog and one paddleboard it's kind of a thing but who knows we'll figure it out and we'll go from there um I just want to say before we jump into the vlog today that today's video is sponsored by Terravita CBD and I will share with you little snippets throughout this video of my favorite products and how I use them and how I weave CBD into my daily life but I wanted to make sure I gave them a shout out right here in the beginning of the video and I think that's all I have to say for now let's jump in
sorry if it's kind of loud here. We're at like a popular boat ramp region for the San Juan. Um, but this morning when we woke up at the reservoir, it was beautiful, but it was definitely a little chilly. So we had our uh, like, it's not a coffee. I don't really drink coffee, but it's called Dandy Blend. And then I make it with like collagen powder and a little bit of almond milk and coconut oil and just like blend it up with the immersion blender. And it's so good. Um, Anyways, had that and then we jumped in the van and drove like an hour or so to Mexican Hat, which is where we're at now, um, to make a little breakfast. It was so good. One of my favorites. Um, and then we're just trying to wear out this little dog over here a little bit because we're going to drive maybe three more hours now on to um, like the Flagstaff area before getting to Sedona later today. I've had a lot of people ask me if Tabor likes the van. Hard no. <laughs> Tabor really doesn't like the van so we try our best to wear her out and then we've been trying things like CBD and everything like that so I'll show you um, something that we've been using for her that definitely helps a little bit but right now we're just trying to get her to like run around and swim obviously it's very effective <laughs> but then we're gonna hop in the van and get on the road. Tabor look at this one this is a good one hey Tabor Truthfully, I don't think we're accomplishing much over here as far as wearing her out. She's just going to be like extremely wet and muddy, so... <laughs> oh well. Okay, so I feel like I should clarify when I say Tabor doesn't like the van. It's not that she doesn't like the van itself. She doesn't mind the van at all when we're not moving. And I think she actually really loves the van adventures because she goes totally crazy when we get to go to new places, but she really struggles when the van is moving. Um, she gets really anxious and overwhelmed and like pants a lot. So something we've been doing since the very beginning is using CBD for her and it definitely helps. Um, right now we're using the Terra Vita pet CBD and this is the salmon flavor, but they also have bacon flavor and it's great for like inflammation and joint pain and stuff like that. But I think what we've noticed the biggest difference since Tabor is still a really young dog is that it really does seem to help with her like stress and anxiety so I'm gonna give her a little bit of this since we'll be driving for the next three or so hours and yeah we'll see you then. Terry does that smell good? Yeah does that smell good? You love the salmon flavor huh? Officially in Sedona. Um, we made the drive over here the rest of the way yesterday after that bike ride that we showed you in 
uh, Flagstaff area and then we just made dinner in the van and um, actually stayed last night at a hotel. Last night and tonight we're staying at a hotel um, here in Sedona because we're actually in the era, area for an event with um, Polaris. It's International Female Ride Day, is that what it's called? Yep. International Female Ride Day. So we're gonna go ride um, the side-by-side, -side, kind of like we did in a vlog a couple of weeks ago, but this time I get to drive, which I'm so excited about. And yeah, we just dropped a taper off at a like Rover sitter. This is not an ad for Rover. We just, this is our first time using it. And it's like, it seems very legit for sure, but it's- Kim's Puppy Palace. It's very stressful to like, to, like tapers just, you know, we've had a couple like when other people watched her, like couple of things were, it's, I don't know, just scary. It's like our child. Dropping your kid off at the first day of school. <laughs> we're probably like the most annoying like parents ever. She's like, okay, great, see ya. And we're like, okay, bye. <laughs> but they have an option to send text update photos. So you better believe we're getting those photo updates. Anyways, that's all I got for you right now. We're gonna head over to um, the uh, ATV, like razor or whatever it's called uh, side by side place and get on with our adventure for the day whoop, whoop. officially back at our hotel room uh it was so fun <laughs> we had such a good day uh, riding on like the side by th side things for polaris and then uh our plan was to go on a bike ride but we ended up having to do a little bit of work and we also were a little bit more tired than we expected to be um it was like a little bit more physically demanding than i expected because you're sitting but i feel like because you're driving and things are like moving around and it's kind of chaotic you're like using your abs and using your arm muscles a little bit i don't know anyways uh it was super fun so then we thought well maybe we'll do like a short little hike and watch the sunset and eat dinner but sedona's crazy <laughs> crazy busy right now and everything took a lot longer than we expected food took longer and then um yeah like all the parking areas were full so we just sat at a picnic area and enjoyed a nice dinner and it was honestly it was really really nice so now we're back at the hotel and i'm I'm not like really bummed, but a little bit bummed because I had this amazing game plan of doing like a little stretching. Uh, we got like a travel Theragun thing. And then I was gonna use my favorite CBD like roll on. It's called the Max Relief from Terra Vida. Uh, and I dug through all my drawers in the van and I must have forgotten it but I still wanna tell you about it because it is literally my favorite. And yeah, it's just like a super easy roll on. It has uh, menthol and uh, I believe it's aloe vera in it. But what's cool about it is the CBD is kind of that like long lasting, um, working on inflammation and pain relief, but then the menthol and that kind of coolness, it's like immediate relief. 
it's so awesome. And honestly, with all the driving, my neck gets really sore. This is something that started happening to me since I had that vertigo episode um, earlier this year, but I will have to make do, but sadly. Please excuse my extremely shiny face. I like to use a ton of oil at night because where I live it's super dry and then we're also in the desert right now which is super dry. But I had to jump back in and say this before I went to bed because I found this in my toiletry kit. I hope you can see the label. Um, but anyways, it's CBD. It's the actually the pure tincture from Terravita. So obviously it's not like a muscle rub, it's a tincture instead. Um, but it has added turpins in it. Turpins? Turpines? I actually don't know how to say that word. But what I do know is that they help with inflammation. So I am super excited that I don't have to go CBD free. And again, just a big shout out and thanks to Terravita for sponsoring today's video. Um, I do have a discount code that you can try out. I'll make sure I just put all the info you need on the screen. And then again, in the description box below so that if you uh, needed a little CBD in your life, you have the supplies. All right, good night for real. Good morning. So we are actually out on the side-by-side -side razor again today. Um, it wasn't a part of the original plan, but after we rode yesterday, we were chatting with one of the managers at Sedona ATV and just telling them how much fun we had. And they invited us out for another day and um, told us to check out this other trail, but to go early because it gets really, really busy. So we're actually, we just parked the rig down there and we're walking up this little hill, I think this is called Submarine Rock. We're on a trail called Broken Arrow. And we're the only ones here. <laughs> it's so crazy. Um, but it's very, very, very beautiful. So anyways, that's all I got for you for now. On to the next adventure. Apparently this area has even, I mean, even so far what we drove is way more like kind of rocky and adventurous. So super excited, super pretty, onward. best job of vlogging it but, but right after we did another round on the um, Polaris razors 
We uh, just did some errands for the van. Sometimes I feel like there's more errands, but we did all the things, filled the water, got gas for our stove, those sorts of things. And then when um, it started to get like later in the evening where it cooled off, we went on a fun hike, uh, met up with a friend that I've been like Instagram friends with for a while, but never met in person. So that was super fun. And then we ended up camping in the van on some beautiful BLM land. And I just did a little work um, on my laptop this morning because it is Monday and Monday's a work day for me uh, in the nutrition coaching um, part of my job. So did that and then obviously you can tell that we're all kitted up for a bike ride. We just got back. I am obsessed with the trails here. It was, so fun. It was so fun. Oh man, um, what a way to end it. So this is a, our end of the Sedona chapter of this adventure. We're staying in the van for a couple more weeks, but we are headed out from here. So this seems like a really good place to end today's vlog. Uh, as always, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up because it really supports my channel. And if you want to stay along for all of the adventures, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I will see you all next week. Thank <music> you.